PowerPoint Club. What is going on? I hope everyone is doing good. Today we are going to talk colours. I'm going to give you 20 of my most used colour palettes together with their hex references and I'll show you how to add these to your presentation masters to up your game. So I've inserted a basic chart here with default colours. Now let's say I have a few charts like this and I don't have time to convert all the bars by hand or I just don't like the colours and I want to change the whole colour scheme for the presentation. Dive into the slide master. To do so, hit view and slide master and click the colour option and let's see what we have. So as we can see, PowerPoint does a pretty good job of providing us with a whole range of colour schemes right out of the box. These are default schemes and will always be here. If you fancy a change from the default option, simply click the colour scheme you want and PowerPoint will apply this colour scheme to your presentation. Your charts, tables and shapes will automatically pick these up. But what happens if you're creating, say, a template that needs to use your corporate colour scheme or if PowerPoint's built-in colours just don't float your boat? Well, you can create your own and it's really easy. So I've created a document here with my most used colour palettes together with their hex references. A hex reference, by the way, is just a unique six digit combination of numbers and letters that's linked to a specific colour. Each slide of colours works really well together as complementary colours and really make a standard presentation jump out. As a treat, I'll provide this file in a download link in the description below so you guys can take this and add any you like to your colour libraries. So say we want our presentation to take on this colour palette. Let's copy these onto our clipboard. Control C on your keyboard or right click and hit copy. Go back into our master slide. Paste the copied colours and let's go ahead and shrink these and move them off the slide as we can delete these once we've added them to our theme. I'm just going to go back and steal a couple of others just in case we can use them. Hit colors and choose customize colors. From here, we get this window of all the colors we are currently using in our presentation. At the top, a dark text color on a light background, a light text color on a dark background, dark background color, light background color. And we have the hyperlinks at the bottom. Let's leave these as they are, as those colors are pretty universal. First of all, let's give this color scheme a name. And it's really as easy as entering the hex value into each color window. Click the color you want to change, hit more colors and choose custom and simply type in the hex reference from above. Go through one by one, adding in your colors. Hit save, and now we're using those colors. Everything gets updated to that scheme. You can quickly access them at any time you want. Believe me, a little bit of upfront work can save you hours down the line. That scheme has been saved to your color library and will always be accessible to edit and rename if needed. As you can see, I have loads I've accumulated over the years and it can be a real time saver to have a few of these up your sleeve. So there we go, easy custom color palettes added to your PowerPoint files. As always, thanks for checking out the videos. I hope you find them useful and you can add something cool to your next project. Please download the file from the link below and get some cool color schemes added to your presentations. If you haven't hit subscribe, please hit subscribe. And if you haven't hit like, hit like. Stay safe 
and I'll see you on the next video.